how else do I determine and measure skill, y'all? Like if we don't have a playbook, then we're operating like most insurance companies do, or most, most insurance sales teams do, which here, here's how most of us operate our playbook. We look at RPM for the scoreboard. Now imagine that we're at the Super Bowl and our entire game strategy. All right, guys, welcome to the Super Bowl. We worked really hard to get here. Here's our play for today. We're going to score more points than our opponent does. Let's go. Yeah. Thank you, coach. Any idea how we're going to do that? We're going to catch more passes. And if we don't catch enough, we'll just catch some more. That's the secret to winning the football game is to make more catches. If we make more catches than they make, we win the game. Some of you aren't drawing the parallel, so let me draw it. We're going to win power weeks. How are we going to do it? We're going to make more calls. If we make more calls, we'll simply close more deals. Go team, go. Did y'all follow that now? Yeah, absolutely. So this is freaking vitally important that you understand skill is not RPM. Skill is not the scoreboard. Skill is not the bank account. Skill is not determined by the checkbook balance. Skill is determined by one metric and one metric or one thing and one thing only, the ability to execute the plays out of the freaking playbook that are tracked and determined by known metrics. So Ben yesterday had a little bit of like, his brain exploded at one point because I don't know exactly what I said, but something along the lines of, you must know your contact to scheduled ratio. Hmm. How many decision makers did you meet versus how many did you schedule? He, something along those lines, he's like, oh my gosh, that's so important. We should know that. Yes, yes, you should. That is a playbook, something out of the playbook with a known metric, scheduled to ran or, or met to scheduled. Well, met to scheduled, scheduled to ran, ran to open. Those are the three metrics. Thank you